Hey guys, Jessica Beck here with IELTS Energy TV and today I'm going to talk about vision boarding. Now, if you listen to our podcast, IELTS Energy, um, you may have heard Lindsay and I talk about this, but um, I want to give you some more details and explain why this is important for your IELTS journey. Okay, guys, if you want to take IELTS only once, right? That means you have to commit yourself. We recommend a 30 day or a 60 day plan. That's really like the optimum amount of time to prepare for IELTS and improve your overall English at the same time. That's why in our course, we have the 30 day and the 60 day study plan, which accomplishes exactly those two things. It prepares you for the exam while improving your English. So guys, okay, your first step is to register for an exam, right? You need that deadline, okay? Again, 30 days from now, 60 days from now. Um, and then you need to get a study plan and really commit yourself to following through with this every day. Again, so you only have to take the test once, all right? So those two things you have to do first. But guys, while you're beginning your IELTS journey, I think it's an excellent idea to create a vision board. A vision board is something that uh, motivates you and inspires you. So get a big piece of poster board, for example. And on this poster board, I want you to put images of your future goals. This could include a picture of your family, um, uh, airplane, travel, a picture of the university you want to attend, the city you want to live in, different pictures and images from that city. It could include words. I always have words on my, on my vision board because I'm very linguistically motivated. <laughs> so it could have the name of your future city. Um, uh, you could have a picture of a job you want to have once you immigrate or once you you graduate from college, okay? You could also have stuff that motivates you like right now, stuff you wanna do right now, like exercise, a picture of someone jogging, right? To remind yourself that physical health and mental health are combined. The better you feel physically, the easier it will be for you to focus on your IELTS studies, okay? So um, figure out what motivates you and what inspires you uh, and what goals you have for your life after IELTS. Get images of these things, uh, put them on a poster board. Now the placement of this poster board is important. Um, I have mine in the kitchen in this spot that I walk past like a thousand times a day, so I always see it. Okay, so post your vision board in a place that you, at eye level, that you are gonna see all the time. Guys, just keeping these goals at the forefront of your mind, it really does work. It really does motivate you, okay? So I encourage you to carry this out and you know it would be cool if you're in our course, you guys, you can come back to the closed Facebook group and actually post a picture of your vision board to share and inspire everyone else. If you're not in our course, you could post below this video. <laughs> Um, okay, if you want to be a Three Keys IELTS member, check out the course and register at allearsenglish.com forward slash K-E-Y-S. Our course is guaranteed to raise your score, guys, so it, it's a long way towards uh, getting that vision complete, so check it out now. Okay, guys, that's it for me. Thank you so much for watching. Stay motivated, stay inspired, and I will see you in the next video.